I was actually heading to another property for the same builder to start a new house, the one where I cleared the trees and such a couple months ago, but then he had me come over here because somebody else has brought in a whole bunch of fill because they're needing to backfill this retaining wall. So there was probably, I don't know, 15 loads of fill, 20 loads of fill right here. I just kind of quickly knocked it down with the uh, 2150. I'm not 100% sure the grade. I think they're only going to come out like 25 feet with concrete and the rest is going to be base and I'm not really sure where the driveway is going to turn. The only thing I do know is we're getting down to the end so money is becoming an issue. <laughs> because they were that's all the clay was to just be backfilling behind this wall. Which they've got some weep holes in there. I told him he's going to need at least a couple of feet of clean rock. Even if they don't put a drain in there. Just to help take the hydraulic pressure off of this wall. Instead of just dumping clay on there. Even though it's got those holes. You need something for that water to run down the edge of that wall. Find that clean rock and find those holes. Because this clay will eventually set up like concrete. And just hold all the moisture and actually push that wall over. So I think I've talked him into like three or four loads of rock, which I'm not even sure if that's going to be enough. He was going to have Lonnie uh, come over here with a slinger and shoot it. That's, that was my job this morning, just knock it down so he can get in there. Lonnie can't get here till tomorrow. And now we may just end up either one, have him this afternoon or even dad just start bringing some uh, clean rock. I'll set up here with the 2150, put the grading bucket on backwards and just start dumping it in there because... I'm going to spend the rest of the day over here trying to rough grade and get some of this ready. So this is one of those uh, roll with the punches day. It's, <laughs> it's nothing at all what I planned on doing. I knew it was coming up, but it's, I mean, it's fine. It's like I said, it's for the same builder. So I guess that works as the other person's thought we were coming over there today. But uh, he's also needs a propane line. And yeah, there's gonna be a little bit of grading here. So I guess there's gonna be stairs here, but they've put those on hold. I think the plan is we'll get the clean rock in and then backfill with clay, just kind of a ramp for now. And then they're gonna come back at a later date apparently and put stairs in there. Behind that wall, he's gonna run uh, a propane line. So they wanna use one of those top weep holes there. And I gotta dig a little trench over to the corner of this and then they can propane power generator. It's got the generac thing over there. I'm not sure, but I gotta dig a little ditch here. So some of this stuff, I just, I don't know. It makes sense to me just to do it all at the same time than make multiple trips back over here. So what I like to do is if I get somewhere, I like to at least spend a day before I have to load up and move. The two smaller machines we're going to stay here because like i said in a couple days we'll be back to doing the water main and i still got to dig the water line in this house looks like our tile guys are showing up so i better uh make sure they're not going to park in the way